Hey everybody, this is the Beware reading for your sign for this month. I'll do three spreads. What you need to be aware of this month spread, the advice spread, and the next good thing that will happen to you this month that will at least put a smile on your face spread. Please like, share and subscribe. Let's begin. Hi Leo, this is the Beware spread. We've got the Six of Wands, the Four of Cups, the Nine of Pentacles and Judgment on the bottom of the deck. Since judgment is on the bottom of the deck, I think this is the main storyline and everything is sort of revolving around that. So, um, um, what you need to be aware of this month is um, if you are thinking about reconciling with somebody and you think that'll be um, an easy street for you, if you think all you have to do is just and they will come rushing towards you if I think you will be mistaken <laughs> um, we've got the four of cups on the table this is a card of uh, rejection and the card that follows is the uh, nine of pentacles this is a single person card uh, a person who doesn't really need anybody at this point of their life because they are feeling fine by themselves so what you need to be aware of once once again is uh, if you think that you can easily get somebody back from the past, they'll most likely say not so fast and they will reject your offer to reboot this relationship. Keep in mind it could be vice versa, somebody could be uh, trying to reconcile with you and you'll be saying uh-uh, not so fast. And that's what you need to be aware of for this month. This is the advice spread. We've got the Five of Pentacles, the Nine of Pentacles, and the King of Pentacles. You could be dealing with an Earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. Um, all three cards are Pentacle cards, so I have a couple of scenarios. The f scenario number one is, uh, this is still about that uh, previous spread, and actually it should be about that previous spread, and you could be dealing with an Earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn, or this is a person who is very good with their money and they're just grounded and they don't make any sudden moves so um, if there is an attempt to reconcile then uh, whoever is trying to get, recon get this reconciliation going will most likely be very disappointed and they will be left out in the cold the five of cups is the card of uh, somebody being left out in the cold and the nine of Pentacles cards is back. This is a repeat card. This is a card of somebody who is uh, fine being single. Um, so like I said, if somebody tries to reconcile, to reboot the relationship, then that person will most likely be disappointed and their offer will be rejected. Another thing I can think of here is this could be about finances because all three cards are about uh, are Pentacle cards, right? So if uh, you're dealing with either an earth sign or this person is uh, works with finances and good about, good with money then there will be some kind of a also a rejection here because the, the five of pentacles is a card of somebody being left out in the cold so um, if you're dealing with an earth sign or, or someone who is very good with money then uh, there is a possibility of either you or them being left out in the cold, whatever the situation is. Let's talk about the next good and positive thing that's going to happen to you, Leo, in April. We've got Strength, the Nine of Swords, clarified by the Page of Cups, and the Eight of Wands. You could be dealing with uh, another Leo. But I think the uh, Strength card is uh, you in this case. This is your personal card. And the... Uh, if you are a little bit worried about extending an offer to somebody else, not the person we were talking about in the previous two spreads, um, then I think you should not worry about it. You should go ahead and, ex and extend this emotional offer. We've got the uh, Eight of Wands, which is a card of Cupid Aries or very fast communication. And perhaps you've been stressing out about it, it's been keeping you up at night. Um, um, it could also be an apology so maybe you got into a fight with somebody or broke up with somebody and now are very anxious about extending an apology to this person um, 
the cards suggest that you shouldn't be afraid, go for it, go ahead. And keep in mind it could be vice versa. And somebody else could be uh, kind of depressed about the whole situation between you and you and them and they're thinking about making an apology, extending an offer to you and uh, at this point of time they are not really sure if they should do it but I think eventually they will gain the strength to extend the offer and they'll go for it. And there you have it. I hope my readings resonated with you and if they did I hope they make your lives better in one way or the other. Please share and subscribe and hit the bell to get notified. Thank you for watching.